Hello. Today we are looking at how to install and use Wine 5.02 on a Chromebook. There are a couple of disclaimers which we need to mention before starting the tutorial. You will need a Chromebook with an Intel or AMD CPU and Linux apps support. Chromebooks with ARM64 CPUs will not work. Lastly, not all Windows applications work with Wine, but we added a database in the video description of all the apps that should work. Let's start. Firstly, we will enable Linux apps on our device. To do this, we will go to our system settings and click on the Linux icon on the left panel. Now we will turn on the Linux apps. Make the Linux folder at least 7 GB big, but please keep in mind that some Windows applications are very big. Now that we have enabled Linux apps on our system, we will move to the next part of the installation process, which is to run several commands in a terminal, which will install Wine. All the commands are in the video description. Now we will copy the first command and open a terminal session from our app menu. Next, we will paste the command into our terminal, either with a two-finger click on your terminal or click Ctrl, Shift and V together. This command will enable 32-bit architecture for Wine on your system. This command should run automatically as soon as you paste it into a terminal session. Now we will download the Wine security key with the next command. Now we will add the Wine security key to our system which we just downloaded. Now we will be pasting the next two commands into our terminal. This will add the Wine repositories to our system. Now we will add another security key that Wine requires. Now we will update our system repositories of our Linux apps. Now we will install Wine. Press Enter to confirm the installation. Now we need to install three additional packages which Wine requires.
Click on Install to confirm the installation. Click on Install to confirm the installation. Click on Install to confirm the installation. Now we will install a Linux file manager, which we will use during the tutorial. Press Enter to confirm the installation. Now we will install the Windows version of Audacity, as an example of how to install applications with Wine. So we will start by downloading Audacity. Now we will move the installation package to our Linux folder in our file manager. Now we will rename this package to wine.exe. Now we will install the package with the next command. As you can see the Windows installer has opened up. We will install Audacity now. Unfortunately, my screen recorder has crashed during this part of the installation, so we will see you in a few seconds. As you can see Audacity is now installed. However, in Chrome OS, a menu launcher for the Wine application was created, but it will not work. So we will create a launcher with the help of the Linux file manager, which we installed earlier. So let's launch the file manager now. Now, we'll make the hidden files of our Linux apps visible. Open the .wine folder. Open the Drive C folder. Your package will either be in the 32-bit or 64-bit folder.
Now right click on the executable package of your program. Click on properties. Copy the path of the package. Paste it into the custom command in the description of this video. Now do the same with the name of the package. Now the launcher is ready. We will launch our application every time with this command by pasting it in a terminal session. Let's do it now. Enjoy wine. If there is a specific application you want us to look at, let us know. Enjoy.